Now I'll be doing another one a lot lately, and it's going to be the um, the Oniko. Now Oniko is more like a traditional snus. Let me um, open it up here so you can see the inside. Um, it came in just general white portions. I'll, I'll post a picture later, but oh, you can see one just fell out there. But the smell, everything else, it's, it smells like fennel. It smells like anise. It's a good quality um, flavor. The bags are nice and moist. It reminds me a lot of the... Um, It reminds me a lot of the Catch Black Licorice. Um, it's a bit sweeter. The flavor doesn't last as long, maybe only about 30 minutes. Um, the Black Shot, the flavor lasts a lot longer, but again, it doesn't taste as good. It's got this weird sourness to it that I just, I don't quite like. Um, and then the last one that I've tried out of the nicotine free ones is the Quit. Um, Quit also has a nice licorice flavor, but it's got ginseng in it, which is kind of strange. It also, the ginseng gives it this, um, this sour kind of flavor to it and i don't know if that's from from what exactly but um it, it does taste a bit more like a regular snus and maybe the ginseng is something that people like i, I don't know um you know we we live here in asia and ginseng is something that we can get um all the time it's not something that's uh rare or uncommon um but the flavor is just a bit strange you know um, the Oniko is definitely the best. Um, I, I don't know if I would pay again the money for the quit and for the black shot, but um, definitely I would pay again for the Oniko just because it tastes most like snus, even if the flavor doesn't last as long as regular snus does. Um, you know, but it also has the most natural tasting flavors. It tastes more like, um, like you know, Anna's tea wood or something like that. So. It's um it's my favorite of the three so far. I do have two more that I haven't tried yet that I'm gonna open up for you now. And um, let me just turn the camera around.